Unlock the secrets of stylish Google Docs. Learn how to create custom page borders easily. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a border to your page in Google Docs. So unfortunately, there is no built-in page border option within Google Docs. So what we'll have to do is kind of build our own border, but it's really not that hard. So first, what you need to do is simply select the page where you want to add your border. Then go up into the top menu and select Insert under Insert, select Drawing, and then go to New. So in Insert, we're going to do is go up in the top menu and select the Shape option. Select Shape, and then go to Shapes, and then select the square. With the shape selected, simply draw your shape. I like to do kind of the shape of a page. It does not have to be that large. And then from here with the shape selected, you can change first the fill color for the shape. If you don't want to have any color, select transparent. We can select the color of our border. So I'll do red. It's easier to see. And then you can select the thickness of the border. After that you can select if it's going to be dashed or dotted. Anything like that. We'll just do a full border. Once we have our border created, select save and close. Now that we have our shape added, simply select the shape and then the menu that comes up at the bottom. Select behind text right here. You want to drag the corners and the sides of the shape to the edges of the page so that you have a border. Now if you find that at the top, it's not allowing you to go up onto the top of the page. With the shape selected, go to the bottom and select move with text and then select fix position on page. So this will allow you to actually move it to wherever you want on the page. Once you have the shape fully extended to the sides of the page, you will now have a border added to your page in Google Docs. Alright, so that's how you add a page border in Google Docs. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel for tutorials.